Hello everyone, this is Hina. Welcome to another video of Telenium Creators and today I'm going to share with you a very simple, very easy technique to create a modern looking logo design that you can easily create in Adobe Illustrator and uh, very simple and uh, most recommended for the beginner. So if you are learning Illustrator and you want to create a logo design and you are professionally creating a logo design, then this tutorial might help you. So let's start with me now. First of all, what I'm going to do, I will simply create a new workspace for this. So creating a new document and here you can note down the details around here and press OK. The artboard is absolutely ready to start our work. And now first I'm going to create a simple background layer here and uh, it, it may, it, I want to keep it soft. So what I'm going to do, I was simply creating a, a grayish white color here and simply lock the layer, press Control 2 from your keyboard and uh, it now it will not uh, distract anymore and creating a simple ellipse like this and give it a simple stroke color here i want to keep it peach color and uh, because i want to create something more pinky or peachy uh, in terms of look so it needs to be so soft uh, because it's an art and craft company and that's uh, going to start so now i'm going to place a stroke on place and here with the three points and now simply converting into the rough in structure for that i have to go into the effect and transform and here rough in the circles you can note down the details the detail is around one inches and size is two percent so you can see that how it will be looking like that and now the next thing that i'm going to do i will create an offset path uh, for the with this circle the offset with the around uh, the offset with around uh, 11 pixels so you can see that how it will they look like now i want to create uh, one more with the same uh, specifications so you can see that how the three parallel or the consecutive circles are there okay, now going to expand the appearance and now you can see that it will look like this and here what I'm going to do, I'm creating a simple a rectangular tool. By using the rectangular tool, I have created a rectangle here and now selecting each and everything together. And by using the shape builder tool, I am simply remo removing, I'm simply removing some areas around the circle. So you can see that how it's going out. And now what I'm going to do, I will deselect it and simply remove this uh, the rectangular part. So it will be look like this. Now the next thing that I'm going to do, I will create a, a brush uh, to create some leaves so for this i have used this ellipse tool and now going to create a simple oval and then uh, by using these uh, pen tool i'm going to make it sharp edges like this and uh, now to making this longer and slim and so after that i will go into the brushes section from the window and here i'm dragging it to create an art brush press ok and now make it uh, you know a smaller in size so and flip along and put, uh, turn the color mode into tints and shades and here press ok and now the art brush is ready to use and now i'm dragging simple leaves structures like this so you can see that this is very simple very easy you don't need to be more perfect to create these leaves because i want to create a realistic look around the uh, circle so this will be look like this and don't uh, make it uh, so many leaves around the circle otherwise their logo will look too busy and heavy in size so i want to keep it uh, like this so if anything goes wrong then you can make it again by press Control Z, and here you can see that how it will be look like this. I want to create it on the edge of the circle to, for, you know, to give it a simple look. Or, or the, uh, here you can see that how it will be going. All the circles are there. So you can see that all the circles are on the circle, the edges of the circle are filled with the leaves and uh, this will add the style in the logo at the same time it will keep it more soft uh, um, related with the business. So the business name is the Christ Corner. Now take the uh, text tool and just write the business name here. I'm going to create it. And now what I'm going to do, I want to play with the main part that is the crease and the remaining the corner the and corner this will look like a simple you know serif i want to keep it in a serif one here i use the normal ui semi light option for this and now creating the spacing between this this will around 360 and now going to reduce it down and press uh, now 
going to walk the decrease and here use the autograph this is uh, also available um, i have downloaded from the internet it's a free font that you can easily download so here i have used that and uh, now what i'm going to do i'm just aligning the text around it and uh, so this is very simple easy to do I like this placing of uh, text, so I did it, but it can be a different one. I have tried different options before uh, creating this logo, but this was the best and it was looking so good in this way. So what I'm going to do now, I will choose the edge of the E and now creating a simple leaves pattern here and it looks so good and to make it more stylish as called uh, uh, according to the theme of uh, this business. This is the art and craft shop that my client is going to start so it will be looking like this now i'm placing it around and now want to keep the color more grayish for this and if you can see that how it will look like now this is very simple very easy to do now the more or less our logo is complete but it needs some more details so if i will go into the but when i go into the close look i can see there are so many more you know things that i need to fix it here so what i'm going to do i will simply select each and everything together so you can see that there are gaps between the leaves and uh, the color is different so i want to fix that so for that i have select each and everything together only want to select these leaves structures and first going to expand the appearance of these leaves and then changing the color match with the circles so it will be look like this now and now after that what i'm going to do i will uh, you know uh, make it more connected with the uh, circles so it will be look like this now so I want to connect it more connected with the circles so if anything goes wrong or if anything is uh, missing then you can still adjust it with the closed look um, yeah, with the closed uh, uh, you know uh, by zooming in and you can see that what are the loops in the uh, uh, so you can see that if there is some error or there are some uh, you know areas that require fixing then you can easily do that and so i'm going to fixing each and everything together here that i'm just thinking is need to be fixed so it will be look like this now if any pattern is wrong it not giving a good look then you can also adjust it accordingly so so here you can see that more or less our logo design is absolutely finished and it looks super soft and match with the and match with the business theme. So this is very simple, easy way to create modern local logo design. Seems super very exotic and very easy to do. Thank you so much for watching. If you like my tutorial, then please hit the like button. Subscribe to my channel. Have a very good day. Bye bye.